Did you know that sound is the most important aspect of any video that you're filming? And research shows that regardless of how good your video quality is, if the sound is not good and with lots of background noise, your viewer will not stick around for too long as the quality of the sound would annoy them. So in today's video, I will show you a free and easy way in which you could not only improve your sound quality, but also remove background noise in a few simple steps. Hello, this is the Tech Girl 007 in here and I'm here to teach you all you need to know about YouTubing, video tips and tricks and don't forget the reviews of the latest and most affordable gadgets to help you create even better videos. If the vocals are not clear and with lots of background noise, magnet for you guys is quite affordable. As you can see, I've got this video and I would like to remove the background noise and as you can see there's quite a lot of background noise on this video so let's go ahead and I'll show you how to do that and for that we're going to be using a program called audacity so I've got this in here it's a free program and I'm not sure if you heard of this before if you have you might have only been able to maybe tweak with some sound but did you know that you can even import videos and you can improve the sound of it in here so to do that we need to download the plugin in here alright so first things first we need to download audacity so I've got the link on the description box below so grab it from there and let's go ahead and download this right so here we go this is the one that we want because we are on windows so I want to click on here then you just want to download the one that's not a zip file you just want just the normal one um obviously you just click on it and it will get downloaded in here it's an exe file so you want to click on it select english here click on next 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 bear in mind that i've already downloaded this program and this is telling me that this file already exists so i'll just say yes and just say next install it just a normal process of installing it so you may already have known how to install this but I just wanted to take you through the process because sometimes they change locations and it's just easier for someone to just demonstrate it to you now you can go next just say finish now we've got audacity downloaded in here as you can see you want to bring in a file a video file obviously the sound of it so we can edit it in here so I'm just gonna go and say open I've got a product that I've just shown you that I've done a review on or going to do a review on I'm not gonna really do it but this is just the, for purpose of this video so now in here it says that you need a plugin to be able to you know insert large files into this audacity program so you want to say okay and to get that plugin you want to go to edit preferences and then you want to go on to downloads here you still want to go on for the windows option again on this page you want to go on to uh, onto the full instructions where it says so you want to click on there now go on to the download page and from here you're looking at this file so it's the version that's 2.2.2 you want to click on it and just install this so you want to say finish now let's go to audacity now and try to locate this so we're still on this page and we're going to try to locate it so on preferences you're on libraries and you want to locate it and this says that it has automatically detected the file that we have just downloaded or the plugin just you want you just want to say yes then you want to say okay right you just want to say all right in here so now let's open the file again which was the review file here we go now we can open it and we can just try to tweak around with it a little bit right so i'm going to just play this for a second right guys so today i'm going to be reviewing as you can hear there was quite a bit of background noise in here right so to remove the background noise you want to select a part so basically you're telling audacity in here that this is the thing that I want to remove so in here obviously it's mainly background noise so then you want to go on to effects noise reduction and then get noise profile click on it and then you want to select all 
effects again and noise reduction currently on the settings for noise reduction we've got 13 and then sensitivity is 6 frequency smoothing is 3 so I just want to say ok for now and let's play that again right guys so today I'm going to be reviewing I can hear a little bit of noise on the background but it's better than before do you agree with that if yes then tell me on the comments below or even if you have something different to say then you can also write it there as well right so before moving on to the next bit if you are getting any value from this video don't forget to hit that like button so i'm going to go and have this all selected go on to effects again go into noise reduction so for the noise reduction i'm going to change this from 13 to 15 and also the smoothness from 3 to 5 so hopefully this time it's going to be much better or otherwise you can tweak around with it yourself if you're not satisfied with the sound quality then you can just take it from there just say okay right guys so today i'm going to be so as you can see there's no background noise on this file anymore and then that's it this is how you actually could remove the background noise from any video that you'd like then you want to go ahead and go to file you want to go to export wave i usually do wave because it's just easier to edit in a lot of programs so just want to say wave and i'll just want to say review review with a sound <clears throat> then just save it say okay right okay guys so I just wanted to quickly show you guys how to implement the new sound that you just saved I'm gonna double click on here select the video we just saved which is obviously review with better sound that's what we saved it as you want to click on plus it's going to drop in here this is the original sound of the video and this is the new one with better vocals right what we want to do is you can either mute this and let it be there if you want it or otherwise you can detach it all together and then it's in here delete it and now you can use the original video with the new vocals or voiceover which is going to be a better option so I'm going to play that now and you can see how clear and crisp this is right guys so today I'm going to be reviewing this really nice and affordable okay so there we go right I do have another video which will show you how to compress amplify or maybe normalize the sound of your video so if you want to find out you can either click on the card above or on the description box below and I shall see you guys on another video don't forget to subscribe, like and share it. Take care. Bye.